Hello everyone, I am Bharati, lecturer in Department of Radiography and Imaging Technology in SNS College of Allied Health Sciences at Coimbatore. Today we are going to look upon a topic, Stereoscopic Radiography, where the illusion of 2D image is created and to form the illusion of 3D image. Let's see the topic detail. Move on to the introduction. That stereo means solid, and scopic means viewing. Where stereoscopic means 3D view, three-dimensional view of an object, like a pixel and voxel, which are used in computer tomography. Where pixel means picture element of a 2D image. The two images are obtained. Then the illusion was created with the help of a lead stone scope which is forming the voxel image like volume element which is 3d image stereoscopic radiography creates the illusion of 3d image from the 2d images where two images are set of images is obtained which is placed in the stereo lead stone microscope stereoscope which will produce the illusion of a 3D image, which is invented by Sir Charles Wheatstone. So that's why the stereoscope was called as Wheatstone Stereoscope. The conventional 2D image does not provide full detailed study, and also the human eye are separated at distance of 7 to 8 cm each other. So each eye views slightly differently from another eye. To create an illusion of 3D images, the stereoscopic technique was used. Let's see the working principle of stereoscopic images. Where two radiography images, 2D images are taken from a different aspect with the help of 10% tube movement for creating the illusion of 3D image. Then the radiography images are placed on either side, like the right side image was only visualized by right eye and left side image was only visualized by left eye. By placing that, the stereoscope which will create a 3D illusion image. This special equipment is called as Wheatstone Stereoscope. So this is a Wheatstone Stereoscope and a stereo binocular in which the mirror gives a reflection of images and creates the 3D illusion where the left eye sees the left eye view and right eye sees the right eye view which combines to form a binocular vision procedure the patient is placed on the x-ray table then a marker is placed on the cassette to determine the right side or left side the patient must be immobilized with the mobilization devices during exposure. During this process, a radiographer is taken on the first film by a vertical central ray. Then the tube is slightly shifted and the second exposure is made on the second film on the same exposure factor with mildly tube tilt like 10 percentage. Then the tube movement must be parallel to the films for both images. So the resulting radiography image have the same density, contrast sharpness, exposure factor, distance and same processing timings but with a small tube rotations like 10 percentage. These radiographics are then placed in the Wheatstone stereoscope where the mirror of the stereoscope creates an illusion so the brain will see the 3D illusion image of the specific body part.